it real I'm independent, I don't need no deal I'm Jaws on the beat, I got flow that kills Do my thing with a few G's, Lauren Hill What's up guys, it's Unders and in this video I want to show you how to make that really quick 808 pitched up snare roll super quick to do in FL Studio So let me show you how to do it First things first, let's go to 140 on the BPM So we're going to bring a sample in 808 snares are going to work for us but we can do this with pretty much any sample we're going to right click on the sample we want. We're going to open in a new channel. OK, we need a fresh pattern. Pattern one is going to be the fresh one for me in this case. Let's just rename it snare roll. And we are going to stick that in the playlist just like that right there. We now need to jump into the piano roll. And we need to make sure the piano roll is targeted to that snare. So at the top, it should say piano roll and then the name of your snare. If not, right click, find it, make sure it's in the right place. So we need to find the root note of the snare. That's going to be a bang on there. Okay, so to do this snare roll, super simple. First, we need to just program in the roll that we're after. So something like on each beat, and then we could double it up. All right, let's go with that. Okay, and we want that to pitch up so it really rises up and starts super low. So the way to do that, we need to make sure we can see this section at the bottom, the control section, right? Uh, if it's just like this, you can't see it. There's three little dots just there. Hover over those, drag it up so we can see this guy here. Where it says control, you've got velocity written next to it by default, and that's going to let us control the level. So let's do a bit of level. Let's have it so it gets slightly louder over time. Cool. And to draw that in as simple as I did, we just need the pencil tool selected. You can just tap P or select it from the top up here. Now next, where it says control, we're going to click on control and we want to go to note fine pitch. And we are going to do the same trick with the pencil to adjust that pitch. Now if we go too wild, it's not going to work. We need to keep this kind of narrow, sort of something like this. And that should hopefully give us the vibe we're after. could be far more dramatic and just have it sweep up at the end. We can do pretty much anything we desire from this point here. And that, guys, is how you make a pitched up snare roll in about a minute in FL Studio. Hope the video was helpful for you. If it was, please bash a like on it, subscribe to the channel. And if you've got any requests of things you'd like me to show in these quick tip videos, throw it in the comments down below. I will see you on the next one.